cell disease occurs in approximately one out of every 500 black or African American births, according to the CDC. Most people have heard of it, but may know little about it. Contrary to proper belief, people think it's something you catch, it's something you're born with, and it usually takes uh, both parents to have the trait. Pamela Goldsmith Denson's husband has sickle cell, and she heads up the local Sickle Cell Disease Association. They started doing uh, the baby testing since 1986. Any child who was born when their foot's pricked in the hospital, a lot of people don't realize what they're running for, and sickle cell is one of the diseases that they run. They take that blood test. Sickle cell is a form of anemia that affects mostly the red blood cells and causes them to change shape. What happens with sickle cell in periods of what we call crisis or extreme stress within the blood, the cells change shape. They become sickle shaped. And when they become sickle shaped, they are really very rigid, so they don't flow very well through your blood vessels. The disease is extremely painful and can result in hospitalizations. We give them lots of IV fluids to hydrate them. That way, the number of sickle cells that are clumped together become less and less because there's more water in between them. Drinking water and staying hydrated is something children with sickle cell disease learn at a young age, but the education process needs to extend to the community at large. That's when we, as an association, go out and advocate any sickle cell client in order to make those cells move readily, they have to have the oxygen flowing through there and they have to have lots of fluids. There is no cure for sickle cell, but the drug hydroxyurea, which increases hemoglobin, is making a difference. When you have an increased amount of baby hemoglobin within your red cells, it protects you. You don't sickle as often. Understanding the disease is helping people with sickle cell live longer, healthier lives. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.